So, hello everyone. Today I want to be talking about the 11 reasons why some millennials don't want kids. And if there's some background noises, it's probably just my guinea pigs. First, I want to talk about what a millennial is. It's a person who was born between 1981 and 1996. The information I want to be talking about today is something I've gotten from an article and I'm going to leave the article down below. The article claims that the birth rates are declining in the US. Birth rates among 20-something women declined 15% between 2007 and 2012. But to go into the reasons why some millennials don't want kids, the first one is money. And the simple fact is that kids cost a lot of money and if you live in a country like the US you even have to pay when you're giving birth in the hospital. And it's not feasible for many millennials with student loans to get a kid. One person says, if I can hardly afford to live well now on my income, how can I be expected to give a child the life they deserve? Another reason why millennials choose not to have kids is the fear of passing down a mental illness. The article says those who have struggled with various mental illness reported being particularly wary of bringing kids into the world. Out of the fear that they would inherit the painful experiences they themselves went through. And I think this makes a lot of sense. Of course you don't want your kid to have the illnesses you have, whether that be mental or that be a physical illness. Another reason that some millennials don't want kids is that they don't want to bring people up in this world. A lot of people don't think the world is a good or nice place to be in and therefore they don't want to bring kids into it. And some people already know that there's a lot of unwanted kids in this world and they don't want to bring more kids into a world where there are so many kids that are unwanted and do not have a home. Our family. Fertility issues can be another reason and for some people they might not feel sad about not being able to get kids and they might not have wanted them to start with. One person says I can't have kids naturally. It's not a sad thing though. A lot of other women get upset when I tell them that but I just say I really have no right to complain about one gift I didn't receive when I have been given so many to begin with. So she just sees it as a gift she just not did not receive and she feels probably blessed in her own life because she feels she has a lot of gifts in her life. So she doesn't complain about one she did not get. And that probably also states that she didn't want kids that much. Another reason why some millennials don't want kids is that pregnancy takes a serious toll on your body. One person states in the article the physical changes my body would go through with the pain of birth is not appealing at all to me. Another reason why some millennials don't want kids is that there's a lot of pressure to be perfect when it comes to having kids. Here the article says Although people who don't want to have kids are often called selfish, our surveys show they are anything but. If nothing else, our respondents were well aware the responsibility to be a good parent means consistently putting a child first and making healthy choices for them. And they didn't feel they were up to the challenge. I really think that this part of the article is very well written. I think a lot of people that choose not to have kids are tired of hearing things like they are selfish. The only thing that would be selfish here is that you got a kid when you know that you're not equipped to take care of a kid. And the child few people does the opposite. They choose not to have a kid because they might know that they do not want them or they're not equipped to take care of them. Therefore, they are not selfish. So I really love this statement from the article. Another reason that some millennials don't want kids is that not all women have a maternal instinct. And personally, I really think my maternal instinct is very low, if all existing. <laughs> One person says, children have always irritated me to no end. And I can really relate to that. All the noises that kids make, 
I find them annoying, even if they're happy, sad, angry, it doesn't matter. I find that kids' noises are so annoying to me. Another person says, I've had multiple encounters with children throughout my life. And it's always an awkward and anxious experience for me. And I'm on, on the same page there. I always feel so awkward around kids and I don't know how to behave or what to do around them. I just think it's really weird to be around kids and it doesn't feel natural to me at all. And another reason is that some people simply don't want to bring more people into this world because they feel that our earth is already overcrowded and they might do it for the environment because there are already enough people on this planet. Another reason is for some people the career might be more important than raising a kid and you prioritize your career before having a kid. One person says here in the article, I don't want to have kids because I'm studying to be a surgeon and I don't think I could give them the attention they need with just a demanding job. So again, that's prioritizing. Another reason is that kids don't fit every lifestyle. Some people just don't want to change their current lifestyle and therefore don't want kids. Last reason, the 11th reason is that not wanting kids should be reason enough. You should not need to have other reasons than that. And my thoughts in general about this article is that I'm not a millennial, I'm from 1997. So I'm not millennial, but still I can relate to a lot of the reasons why these people don't want kids. And I think it's so cool that there's more and more awareness on the people who do not want kids because we simply do not all want kids. And it's all right not to want kids. And I think an article like this makes us more all right. It makes it more normal not to want kids. So I think that's really great. But yeah, guys, that was this video for today. I really hope you enjoyed it. And I really hope that I'll see you soon in another video. And if you're new here, my name is Catherine. And I make content all about being child be by choice. And all about living a life with intention. So... I hope you subscribe if that sounds interesting to you and I hope I'll see you soon in another video. Bye guys!